as a last step we can do is uh, you can add some uh, you can use the green channel and the blue channels in the vertex colors to apply different uh, absorption values like for for example here I have got cascade absorption and an edges absorption set up like this right and um, I assigned these values like for example gonna look for absorption and for example if you look at the edges absorption as you can see what is it doing All right so in non-realistic games where you are allowed like to go crazy with colors this can be really cool like in a magical forest or something and the cascade absorption is just coloring this region right so just something like that should be enough right and one last um, issue is you have we have this UV stepping uh, effect because essentially there is like too much resolution here and the vertices are just overlapping and yeah the sweep node in Houdini doesn't do a great job with uh, with high resolution inputs so the way to fix this is first thing you need to set the resample resolution to 2 alright as you can see now it is much cleaner and in order to make sure our cascades remain the same if you go to your resample node here you can set resample by polygon edge and set here instead of straight edge set it to interpolating curves all right so make sure to set the same parameters like this and then save this all right as you can see the water cascades um, retains some of its shape okay so i'm gonna say save asset and here i'm gonna say re-import and then rebuild all right Uh, what we can also do is slightly just the resample now zero eight seven five one point five yeah but one point five still gives us this issue so we need to just find something that works regarding the the attribute noise that we got here right I'm just gonna move it somewhere here All right and with that in place I'm gonna just say save asset and then say reimport and rebuild. All right, and I will just adjust the water surface uh, width so you can go to. 
somewhere here water surface width I'm gonna set it to five six right and let's see we can slightly reduce the scale here and maybe we can set this to one but yeah we still have this stepping issue but overall i mean i i I think this is what we need um, ideally what we should what you should do next is um, maybe deal with this stepping issue uh, it's most likely caused by uh, the sweep node you know generating wrong UVs one quick solution to get rid of the stepping effect uh, what I did is I simply um, adjusted uh, disabled this use uh, I enabled the second option disabled this one and they made sure to set this to double the scaling here also um, I I had these parameters, I don't think they affect the stretching part. Um, you can use also stretch around turns, set to 10. And I added something like this, uh, like fuse. So some points, you know, um, in areas with a slightly high curvature like this one. They just get merged together, so this guarantee when um, when uh, this, when uh, the river mesh is created, and these close points uh, scale is quite high, it might help with preventing um, like overlapping geometry and stuff like this. This is not best solution, but it but helps, right? And like you can always do more smoothing here, right? You can do something like that. This will definitely help, right? But you need to you need to be careful uh, because you have the water cascade. So yeah, maybe not a very good I idea right now you can just set this flat and yeah i guess that's it you you can have this uv smooth also might help a little bit but yeah And save this, go back to Unreal, and then just say you re import and then rebuild. Alright, as you can see, it looks better. So you still have those stepping here, um, but yeah like in some other areas like this one looks cool right you have the water cascades looks cool right all 
we can just try to reduce the scale here a little bit we can also increase this right also make sure when you edit this you don't lose your water cascades right one one five All right, I guess this brings us to the end of our uh, tutorial series. Um, I hope you did learn um, new skills uh, that you can use and build on top of it. Um, so remember to join our Discord channel. I'll leave the description, uh, the link in the description. And yeah. Thanks and uh, see you next time.